Hello and welcome back to this Trails from Zero Let's Play with me, SLJ RPG. In the last episode, oh sorry guys, in the last episode we made it through the third sanctum, got to this rest point, and we no doubt now we'll have to face off against something rather nasty. So let's go and see what it is. And here at last, is it going to be Ernest? That voice, Ernest. Okay, I've definitely seen this creep before. The would-be assassin on the mayor. If the SSS didn't put a stop to him. Oh, you bought bracers, and you cooperated with the inn earlier too. You're quite a lot of friends, don't you? You can call the quips. Unlike the mafia and guardian force, who are completely in control, aiding and betting willingly is just going to add more time to your sentence. You know that, right? What crime have I committed? Laws merely. Childish rules created by mankind to reign in the weak. From today onward, Crossbell shall become a new glorious holy land. Knowing that, why would I bore myself with petty rules such as laws? Ernest, please. Our words are useless. Leaves us no choice, then. How have you met Gunter? And your motives behind all this madness? We'll find those answers after when we question you, after all this is said and done. But for now, stand aside and let us pass. You wish to pass? Very well. My holy comrade has bestowed on me the power to reach wisdom. Feast your eyes upon the power of Gnosis. This again? Who's he gonna transform into? Demon Ernest. He's a big fucking wolf man. Demonization. Those meth units were nothing compared to this. And he's got the dragons. An extraordinary feeling. With the power of a demon, I finally transcended humanity. It's the path of wisdom. Gnosis. Ernest, how could you let this happen to yourself? How much lower must you sink until you're fully satisfied? It's too sad to watch. No matter what form you take, no matter what wisdom you claim to possess. Ernest Rice, you will now place you under arrest on the charge of interfering with public duty. Hmm, interesting. So. We're gonna crash bomb. See if we can blind him. If we can, then that is obviously gonna be a big help. They all resist. Okay, that's fine. Double Zamba. Okay. You dick. For that you shall pay. After I have found what I'm looking for. No, we're not going to do the Zerum Powder. We're just going to do a Celestial Bomb. Then we're going to do a... Mm, I want to see what this thing is, really. What it's weak to. So let's do a battle scope. Okay, so dark matter is the way to go. That's what we've learned here. We're going to do an S break in just because we can and gain a little bit of damage. And then. Hmm. Let's use the battle scope once again, but on these guys. So we know what we're doing for these. Okay. Dark matter it is. Gale of evil. It's not handy, honestly. But I actually think we're going to be okay. Oh my god, they hit so fucking strong. It missed. That is good. Okay. I'm going to try this. Nice. And then we're going to do one of these. And see what the flicker does for us. We get a crit there. Okay. We'll attack here. One, two. We're going to get a Fortuna. It hits all of us. What does it give us? ATS and ADF up. I'll take that. And then let us use the Dark Matter once again here. My god. 
Will you fuck off? <laughs> Another gale of evil. None of us are dead, however. Okay. We're gonna heal ourselves here. Okay, okay. Then I'm gonna give a... One of these to your boy. Nice, and he does not die. It's very good. We get a crit here, so hopefully this will help take out the guys at the back. It doesn't. But what we can do is, once again, heal up your boy. It cures the burn as well, which is ultimately what we want to get rid of as well. Nicely done. Let's try and take out these big boys at the back. We get a miss and a counter. It's actually very handy. Please miss. We get a counter. There we go. An absolute zero is going to hit all three of them. So let's get that on the go. As we get, are we going to get a whole bunch of these? We get one out of the way. We get another Axel Rush. Let's just attack the demon out the back. Nice. Get rid of these guys. Give him less support to go on. Seems like a good idea to me. He's focusing his power. Let's try and get rid of as much as we can here. Uh, Dark Matter as well. Because we get a rush. See if this will do us any good. Ah, we're so close. Burning finger. Nice, but we are okay. We are okay. Let's use the terror once again onto your boy. Get a dark matter going. What we are going to have is a dark scorpion coming soon as well from uh, Randy. So let's attack here. Use this to use our Dark Scorpion. Do a little bit of damage. Shadow Ritual. Oh my god. I mean, it hits hard. Swelling Hope. Okay. Celestial Balm to Randy. Then if it's Tio again... A Celestial Balm to Ellie as well seems like a good idea. Before we do this. And do a Rising Sun. Terrial Balm to Tio. Who's then going to protect us all from whatever attack we've got coming up. This works perfectly for us because we've got the guard, actually. So attacking here. Getting a Tira on to Lloyd because he's weaker than most right now. Also seems like a good idea. And although this is a crit, it will not harm us. Nicely done. We'll do a Chaos Brand. Because why not? Attack with Lloyd. Get the CP up as well. Then. Your job is to heal. We're going to heal with everyone else. I think that that's the best course of action. Get everyone in tip top fighting shape. Focusing his power is fine. It's only T.O. who's going to be affected by all of this. Uh, we'll do a Death Spiral because we know that it's a good little thing. Attack with your boy. It doesn't really do much. Sorry. 
75 again. Mm. Burning Finger, who's he going to choose? Ellie, she's going to guard it. Fine with me. Do another heal, but onto yourself. Let's do a Death Storm. Can't really go that far, unfortunately. 666, number of the beast. Okay. We got a group attack coming up that we kind of need to move on to someone that isn't. Ah, we're going to use that anyway. Trying to get it away from the Oliver, from Joshua, because I would have liked the group attack, to be honest. But what can we do? Uh, we will summon Zite, because I am a big fan of bringing the wolf in. He's going to use a chrono down. I'm not sure it's going to have any effect. It resists it. Okay, that's fine. But we get a fang here from Zite. Nicely done. Hopefully, whatever is chosen here goes up against one of the guys with the guard. No, he goes for you, girl. But she is going to be okay, thankfully. Straight up attack with, with everyone else. Energy circle. To heal and remove elements from ourselves. Let's just do a triple burst. 360, and then surely now this guy should be done. Yes, there it is. Ernest bites the dust. And we get a level up for everyone as well. It's very, very handy. Nice. And we get some, some more celestial bombs. <sighs> the truck is no joke. Without that. Without it, that would have been wouldn't have been nearly as hard. He was tough as a certain other former major secretary wishes he is. Talking about Gunther, to be fair, Ernest seems to have proper background in martial arts. That gnosis. How can it push people beyond human limits? Hmm. Arrest him. Is he breathing? Yes, somehow. The overexhaustion will keep him out of commission for a while. I see. For now, our best course of action is to leave him here and move on. True, our friend. Here can face the face first in the dirt, but we ain't stopping him. Yeah, there's no point loitering. Any time, move out. I know. Farewell, Ernest. Ernest is unconscious. Let's grab our chest. A solar pendulum. Your friends are the only treasures you'll ever need to know. How very nice. As we make our way further down this pathway. I'm guessing we're going to be coming to the fourth sanctum next. Feels like there's still some stuff. This is blocked. So I'm guessing there's a way for us to grab that at another point. We're going to go this way first because I spy a treasure chest. Get a mega duta. I should start looking at these accessories really shouldn't I that I've been picking up. So what's the mega duka? Is a prevent seal Pendulum. Solar pendulum. They're all okay. They're nothing too crazy. I'm actually going to keep what I've got on. On me. As we enter the fourth sanctum, we'll do a little bit of this. Let's fight some monsters. And get some chests. Let's take out the ones with absolute zero. They both resist, however. Okay. Attack with Randy. The guy with the sword is going to attack in a similar way. That's fine. What are these guys weak to? Cool. So. Let's do an aerial here. Because we know that one of them is definitely going to be affected by it. We'll attack here with Ellie. Death Scythe is not going to do much. I don't believe. But we get a counter anyway. Lloyd with the aerial.
boom, as we see them both off. Very, very nice. Nicely done. As we get a whole bunch of XP for that. Very, very nice. 130. So. There appears to be only one way to go, so let's head that way. There's nowhere to go that way. As we're entering outside here for the first time, we've fought one of these before. The Quetzalcoatl's. It's a Kagrasp this time around. Okay. Uh, let's just hit it with an Aerial Sickle. Hope that that's good. Let's use. We can't even use our Analyze. Let's use the Battle Scope then. Yes, and it is weaker to. Uh, the electricity like I thought it would be. We're just going to attack it here. We don't want it to go too far, to be honest. As long as Randy can do his aerial sickle. I mean, it's actually not that effective. But that's fine. Let's just get a spark dine on him. Then attack with Randy. His physicality is his best weapon. Nice as we see this guy off. We shall take it all. Thank you very much, my man. So, we can see that there is... We are missing a uh, box from somewhere up there. Head back this way. As there is a lever. So, before we do anything with the lever, we're going to... Going to see if there's I can get this treasure chest up here. Use the Rising Sun, get a crit, kill them off in one go, and actually give us a whole bunch of experience as well. Nicely done. That's what we want. Let's grab this. Found a Terrial Bomb. And there's another way there. Okay. I Let's explore everywhere before we do the switch, really. I'm sure the switch will come in handy for us to do something at a later point. But if there's still ways to go, we'll take out this guy. Let's so get a successful ambush. A vampire. Okay. He's not that strong. Which is good to know. I will check out with Lloyd's battle scope. Because uh, he's got this, he can see stuff anyway. Water is what he's weak to. Very nice. So we'll attack here, and then we'll just set up some water attacks for the next one. With your girl. So a blue drop. Then we'll attack with Randy. To be honest, we might not need this... <laughs> Thing, because we get that big separate increase anyway, and there we go. Nicely done, 72. So we came from there. This way is blocked. What are these floating things? That's what I want to know. As there is a big old chest here, so let's fight this chest. <sighs> okay. Take out three of them. Very nice. Analyze the big statue in the back. Golden statue is weak to uh, something we don't have on anyone else, so that's fine. Attack here with your boy. He's going to attack Lloyd, which is fine. Something that we don't have here, so let's attack with... Thing. The statue is coming up. Oh, okay. Okay, you little dick. We'll do a death spiral on it. And we'll do a soul bear there. So, death spiral on the statue. That does fucking nothing. But, Fang Flicker is coming through. Nice as we get the attack delay off there. Take out two birds with one stone here. Get an overkill. There, let us use our healing ability onto Lloyd. Because my guess is he's going to... It missed. It's very nice. We don't get a counter or whatever. Soul Burr does like nothing. Let's just take it down with physical attacks. It's not going to be that handy either, to be honest. Uh, attack, attack. 
Okay. We'll do the analyze. It resists it, so we don't actually need that. Bollocks. It's going to cause some more allies. That's fine. All you're doing is lamenting your own fate at this point. This guy's going to get a crit. It's not too bad, actually. Let us do another death spiral. Attack with Ellie. Get this ally out, out the way. Take out the ally. Boom, boom, boom. Get some healings here. We get a miss and we get a counter with Randy. He's going to use his death scorpion. Still a decisive amount. Let's attack here with Ellie. And then see this guy off with that. Okay. Very nicely done. 307. Woo. It's a very decent amount of experience that we needed. I will take all of that. Celestial Mum with some more battle scopes. And we get an Orion Guard. So this is what an existential crisis feels like. It certainly does. So. I think we're probably good. After this battle to say. That if you've enjoyed this. Please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Where we try and take on a bit more of this fourth sanctum. We dealt with Ernest rather six. Ah, this thing can do blind. It's actually very good. So I will see you next time. Where we'll try and figure out the mystery of this fourth sanctum together. One done down. 72 still. We're going to get, gain all the levels here. So, if you've enjoyed this, like and subscribe. I'll see you guys then. Peace.